All I can say is thanks for your time. Thank you, Bear Friends. Thank you, Namdi Kano. Thank you, Master Simon Eba. Thank you, uh, everyone who has really contributed. Thank you, Ifani, Ejio4, and Ejimako. Uh, Thank you, everybody who have been participating in this very mission to restore Biafra. Yes, Namdi Kano is heading to become the first Biafra president because already there is a discussion on ground that will warrant his victory to submerge and that is where the whole thing lies that is where the whole thing lies in accordance to everything that we have been saying everything we have been spreading undoubtedly we have come to realize that Mazen Nandikan is heading even though he's not heading to become the president, he's heading to select the first president of Biafra. We have a lot of mouthpiece outside the country that have been making several efforts to see that justice is being served. And of course, if justice is not served, then a lot of things will eventually go wrong and that is the biggest part of it the biggest mistake that should not be allowed to be made and therefore this is just the beginning this is just the beginning where everything lies where the truth where justice where uh, what would I call it, where um, the fortitude of Biafrans truly lies, and this is just the beginning. So, along the line, a lot of things have been played well. A lot have been played well. Biafran actualization have been played well. That is why I started with thank you, everyone. You see, I have a GB. Yes, okay, B. And when it's going to end, all of you will be very, very much surprised that it really ended. Forget what is happening in the zoo, of course. The lies, the hatred against Umi, but we saw it during the election. We saw how they asked Igbos not to come out and vote in the election. So, Ani is not the full Ani Kanaya. Hoka is the full Ani Kanaya. Anaya Kumande. Mande, Nde, Ofem Wano. But uh, we cannot generalize it because uh, this is just uh, the, the, the most uh, synonym point of it and the most accurate part of it. Biafra today, Biafra tomorrow, Biafra must be restored. So, Mochineke, I told you, Mazen Namdikano is already heading to that very point that he will, he will be the Biafra president or he will be chosen. He will be in the position to choose the first Biafran president. These two things must happen. Let me bring you back to one of his comments or one of his brokers where he said that um, restoration of Biafra, when he's done with his job, the suffering of the people, because whether you like it or not, Nandikan has gone to suffer for the Biafrans. He has gone to pay a heavy price. Getting to two years now, by June, he, it will be getting to two years that this Nigerian government kidnapped him and kept him captive for just saying the truth and telling them, this is what you will do. A lot of atrocities have been heard about the Nigerian government outside the diaspora. And that is where it has gotten interesting. So, mind-blowing is something that should be corrected. And, uh, of course is eventually corrected everything will be definitely put in place that is just the beginning all right one thing i have always said is that one once an can is released the next most thing you should do is is not to even say anything let him don't say anything at all let him remain silent that's the best and most productive maturity I can uh, what is it called I can advise him to do most advanced and productive uh, 
maturity that I would advise him to do. Because now is no longer a time to try to convince anybody that Biafra is going to be a beautiful place, no? That hour has passed. At least everybody is now seeing it for themselves that Nigeria cannot be won. They just lies that have been told all along. It has been lies from here and there. It has been lies from from the pit of hell that Nigeria is one. But the most important question here is that no matter how this lie continues to be continued to be told, the truth must prevail someday. That's the biggest the biggest part of it. It has begun to happen. It is now everywhere. And uh, even so many people came out after the election and they started apologizing to Pierre France or IPOB members for not believing that not believing in them and in their struggle. So when Namdi Kano comes out now because he will soon be coming out I will advise that he should not invest his time in talking. The information has been passed and the message has been received. And that is where we want them to be. He doesn't need to struggle again. By the time he comes out, the only thing he needs to do is to state facts, one or two facts, and that ends it. The next thing is Biafra referendum. So. Let's be guided with everything humanly possible to, to make sure that this great valley of acquired knowledge is not wasted on talking and talking. It should be invested more in production and liberation. Nigerians have understood the language and uh, they, they, they have really felt sorry. They have really felt sorry because eventually they now understood that believing that Nigeria will ever work was a big mess. But not forgetting that those who came out to vote were not stupid. They did the right thing. And uh, let whatever the supreme being take it from here, whatever that is going to come out of it.